Good evening. The writing is on the wall. In this case, literally, vandals are waging a war on the heart of the city. Downtown Albuquerque is seeing a big spike in graffiti, and cleaning it up is time consuming and costly. News 13's Kayla Ayers is live in the Newsplex with more. Kayla? Jessica, fighting graffiti in downtown Albuquerque is a constant battle, but the recent spike now has Albuquerque police involved. There's some street art that's welcome, that enhances, even beautifies downtown. And then there's this. Right here behind 300 Central Southwest. Ambassadors with the downtown action team walk the streets and alleys daily, checking for graffiti that popped up overnight. On walls, near rooftops, on windows, vandals leaving their mark. The DAT says they're also hurting downtown's chance at revitalization. It's um, vandalizing private property and or public property and it is an issue it costs money to to fix these problems or to, to you know address it last month the DAT says it became a big problem over 50 percent more graffiti popped up than during the previous January we were seeing on a daily basis anywhere from 80 to 110 115 graffitis <laughs> The DAT tries to make new tags disappear within 24 hours. The city's graffiti task force provides them with paint, graffiti remover, and paint rollers, and a lot of the manpower is community service. Still, the DAT says it's costing them a good chunk of change, up to $200 a day. We're spending 32 hours to 40 hours a week battling graffiti tags. Albuquerque police has set up its camera tower in parts of downtown with a lot of graffiti in the hopes of identifying taggers and citing them. The downtown action team is hoping community diligence will pay off and that people will report new graffiti to the city or any known taggers to cops. Back to you. Okay, thank you, Kayla. If you see any graffiti, call the City of Albuquerque's hotline, 311. For more on 311 and how to report, check out krqe.com and click on links.